Hello, hello, hello. Welcome back to another episode here on the Regrowth World. I hope you guys are still enjoying this. I'm having fun still in the pack. There's so much to do. I feel like we haven't made a ton of progress, and this episode, it's not going to be a ton either, but I'm going to do my best to get a few things. We There's a few things that have been troubling me, and a couple people mentioned them in the chat and stuff like that in the comments, but there's some quality of life changes that we can definitely do and probably should have done a long time ago. So, let's get back to where I was. Alright, so, uh, baubles are an interesting thing added by Batania. And there's three that I usually want. One is the Soldier's Sash. Now that I have leather, I can do this. See? See where I'm getting at here? The Ring of Chordata is another one. Uh-huh. Good, good, good. We do need to go fishing for that. Mmm. That might be a pain. And the Ring of Magnetization, which we needed gold for as well. So, uh, let's see. I need mana lens, which is four mana steel. I need eight mana steel for this bat. What? What am I doing? What? What? Okay. I need eight mana steel for this guy. Oh, boy. Okay. Uh... Eight. Eight. Good. Uh, I need a piece of gold. One piece of gold. And glass, I think I have on me. Okay. Let's get the ring of magnetization. All right. Let's do it. Let's do it. Okay. So this goes like this with this. No. Why do I forget it so fast? Okay. Mana lens. It's a glass pane. Oh, really? I hate making glass panes just to use one of them, but oh well. Okay, we got that. We're going to then put in a piece of the iron with a piece of the gold, and that should give us the magnetizing lens. Beautiful. Now that, uh, that goes around with the lens in the corner. Okay. Uh, bam! Ring of Magnetization. Beautiful. So basically, when you go into your inventory, uh, you're going to see this other little ring here, and you can click that. At, that's going to open up your baubles section on the right-hand side. Now, the cool thing about the ring, ring of Magnetization is simply this. You know when you're farming this stuff, and you're kind of away from it, say like this? Or, you know, you're just kind of running through... And, you know, you're trying to get as many as possible, blah, 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 nice and quick, right? Well, with the Ring of Magnetization, as you guys saw, there's none lying around. And I basically am picking up everything, which it has been really annoying. I hate, I absolutely hate going back for missed drops or anything like that that I was farming. Um, and it was happening... A lot with these magical crops uh, so very happy to have that that's very good and we can we can grow from there um, as you can see I've started to expand out my dirt empire um, slowly trying to spread the grass around we have a lot more grassiest area up here but pretty awesome I am very very happy with the ring of magnetization the next one was the Soldier's Sash. A uh, very nice little sash. It basically increases your movement speed, jump height, resistance to fall damage, and it also allows you to walk over one block height. So earth and air and a mana steel. All right, one mana steel. Uh, do, where, did I, where did I put my leather? Or did I use it all? I honestly don't remember. Did I end up using all the leather that I had? I might have. Oh god, noisy cows. Noisy cows. Actually, that reminds me while we're here. Let's jump in. Uh, friendly creatures. Thank you. Hostile creatures. Thank you. That's better. That's better. They won't be as bad. Okay, now do I have the runes? I have the rune of the air, but I don't see a rune of the earth here. Uh, so I'll have to make one of those. That's no big deal. Let's go get some leather. And I'm going to get the rune of the earth as well. Okay, good. That's enough. 
That's enough. Close. Beautiful. Okay. Good. A little bit of beef. A little bit of beef. Where's the beef, yo? Oh, I had a little bit right there. It's fine. It's fine, guys. It's fine. Uh, okay, so what do I need for the Rune of Earth again? Mana Steel, Stone, Coal, and a Mushroom. Okay. Uh, we can do all of those things. I need a piece of stone. I need a piece of coal block. Excellent. Do I have a mushroom in here? Mushroom? Mushroom? No. I got some over here, though. Let's go get some of those. I wonder how my 10 by 10 farming is going and stuff. There's so many things, guys. It's amazing, all the stuff that we need to do. I, I'm too excited. I apologize. All right. Boom. Uh, yeah. Let's get a little bit more iron on the agenda. Excellent. We'll put that in there. Yeah, I'm sure we'll use it at some point here. There we go. Get out the block. I need three more mana steel. Okay. Good. And as you can see, it's barely even denting our mana pool here. One, two, three, four. Good. Boom, boom. We're going to get this thing all crafted up. Mushroom. And one, two, three. Boom. Get that going. And you know what? I'm going to be right back, guys, once this is all done. Because you've seen this four bajillion times already. And, you know, you don't want to see it again. All right? So we're going to put this like this with our leather. Uh, our rune of the air there, and all we need now is the rune of the earth. I guess I won't skip it, because we're done. Okay, good. Excellent. Soldier's sash. Beautiful. So again, the baubles, and you equip it. Oh, it adds a little, little tiny detail there. That's so cute. Uh, but as you can see, I've increased in speed like a madman. I can do these one-block step-ups. Uh, that have been really annoying for a very long time. Hiya. And equally, as you can see, my jump height is increased. Okay. So, I think at this point, we got some pretty nice things here. Um, I haven't even opened this yet. Um, no. There. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah. You. Okay. Good. So, all this is done. I still need to do the blaze one. I need to get some of the nether stuff going, which we might have some now. Um, and we need to finish the issue with the natural uh, gas thing that we had over there. And yeah, so I'm going to do some farming with my new ring of magnetization. And get some of this stuff done. Alrighty, so I decided, you know what, if we're going to do this, we might as well do it right. So let's get some string, some sticks, and let's make ourselves a sifter. Alright, I have not done this yet. Uh, actually, ooh, do we even have string? Oh, that is a great question. We might not have any string. Well, dang. Uh... Okay, that's a bit... Oh, wait, I have cotton, right? Yeah, I got cotton somewhere. Where's my cotton? Is it down? Ah, yes, that's right. It's in my white bag. Yes, there it is. Okay, good. Woo! It's a little nervous there. Got a little bit nervous there. Good. Five string, like so. Uh, we need a couple more sticks, like so. Let's get this sifter going okay that with that and this should give us two sifters oh wow okay oh that's right they go together i remember now okay so this is part of mariculture so let's just place them down beside each other and there you have the sifter i'm gonna claim my grasshopper bait uh fishy situation we need a reed fishing rod okay we can do this these quests, I've kind of just ignored them for the most part. Um, but they were all pretty easy to do. Um, so let's get this reed going. We'll get the reed fishing rod. I believe that's some more string, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Let's see. Uh, reed fishing rod. Yeah, two more string. Okay, 
It's the standard recipe. I'm going to need more cotton. Holy cow. Can't believe we've already gone through that much. Okay, read fishing rod. Good. All right, we got a new book. Fishing and breeding. Okay. Introduction. Fishing. Fish oil and all the different things you can do with it. Fishing rods and all the different types of rods. Okay. Um, aquatic environment analyzer. Biome defaults. Okay, this is all the stuff on where fish are and all that jazz. An automatic fisher. Well, that sounds terrific. I like that. Hatcheries. Oh, God, that's right. You can breed fish at this thing. I remember now. That sounds just terrible. <laughs> All right. Good. Uh, let's quickly check our quest book here and see what we got. Detection task. We need a cod. Okay. We need some cod. So if I'm not mistaken, you need the bait with the bar and you just throw it in the water. And we wait. We're waiting. We're waiting. We're still waiting. Does anybody else despise fishing? I do not enjoy fishing in this game. In the slightest. Like, I should cast a rod. Two seconds later, it should be a fish. And I should move on. Agreed? Because I think so. Look at this. This is taking way too long. How am I supposed to make a good video when it takes this long? Hiya! Sucker. <laughs> so that requires a cod. What did I get? A damselfish. Are you real? Is this real life? Well, anyways, I'm going to fish until I get some fish. And then I guess we'll uh, go from there. Apparently, I need a cod, which is decent in fish and chips. But I prefer my halibut with my fish and chips. Yeah! Oh, clownfishy. Clownfishy. Okay. Okay. This is going to be annoying. I'll be right back. Huzzah! What? Oh, what? I got cod. Oh, my God. Okay, what do I have to do? You've got a rod. Now catch a fish. Um... To catch live fish, you'll probably want to stand in the water. Is that dead fish then? Oh my god. Have I been catching dead fish? Okay, so if I stand in the water. Okay. Alright, I'm in the water. Are you freaking kidding me? Alright, let's try it. Oh, well, see, it's not working. What the heck, man? What the heck? All right, I'll keep fishing until I catch a different type of cod, I guess. Maybe there's something else that I need to do. I'll have to look into the reading of the book and all that kind of stuff as well, but I'm going to keep catching fish. We'll just use up most of our bait. Cool? Cool. Alrighty, I'm really confused. Um, apparently, I caught a live cod. I don't know where this item may be, but hey, I'm all for it because I went through all of my bait and I am so glad to be done with that quest. Feeding time. Fish feeder and fish meal. Okay. Uh, live fish. You want to build a tank for them in. Different fish species require different size tanks to live in. Oh, God. Uh, nope. Nope. Nope, not doing it just yet, guys. Not going to happen. All right, we have some fishing rods. It tells you what bait you can use with them if you hover over them like such. But you know what? We have enough food to carry on with the items that I wanted to carry on with. So uh, let's put some of this stuff away, this stuff in particular, and the carpet. I'm running out of places to put stuff. Big time. Um, yeah, you can go in there for now. Good job. Uh, oh, that's full of fish oil. Oh, wow. Okay. Okay, that's a good fluid tank. It's full of fish oil. Okay, I'm going to keep that here. Uh, we'll deal with that soon. But I wanted to make myself the Ring of Chordata. Okay, now for that, you need a raw puffer fish and a raw salmon. Um... 
Do I have either of those things? I have a raw puffer fish. That's good. Do I have a raw salmon? I don't think so. Clownfish, cod, squid, etc. Okay, let's get this cod out, all right? Now, it does require a raw salmon, so we're going to need exactly that. Uh, we definitely need about four things of mana steel as well. One, two, three, four. Good. That's beautiful. Um, now, how are we going to get this? Well, we need salmon. Uh, I think it's time. Actually, can we do the quest for this? Let's see. Uh, is it here? It's still locked, hey? Eh? Why is it locked? Okay, well, you know what? It's time. We're going to do it anyways. I don't care if it's locked or not. Uh, let's get some cobblestone. One, two, one, two. Good. I think I always get this backwards. Oh, I got it right that time. Amazing. Okay, we got the nether bricks starting to pile up. That's good. We're going to get ourselves the alchemy catalyst. That's the guy right there. And I don't care if we're waiting on other stuff or not at this point in time because I'm sick and tired of waiting. Okay, four of you and a couple pieces of gold. Now that we have it, we can use it to our full advantage. Beautiful. Okay, uh, we're going to remove you and you. Place that underneath. Place back the dirt. Awesome. Okay, so now we can make different things. So this cod, for example, if you hover over it, what did that give us? Raw salmon. Nice. Very, very, very nice. So that with that. And what was the last piece again? The rune of the water. Nice. We got it. Good. I don't have to make any more. Ring of the Chordata. 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 I don't know what it means exactly, but it's fine. I don't know the exact saying. And we have ourselves a mana tablet, so that's going to be mighty useful as well. Uh, let's just put away our Lexia Batania and our bookbinder as well. Good. Now, if I'm not mistaken, we can now swim underwater with mana for breath. Nice. Okay, good. It does work. Now, obviously, you saw my mana pool and whatnot drop very, very fast, right? Or my uh, life, because it doesn't really fix the problem that we had in terms of the changes to the water. But with the diving suit on, I should... Oh, my. I swear to God, I'm not swimming that direction... Oh my. Okay. Okay. I swear to God, I'm not doing this, guys. Okay. Okay. Alright. Is it just all of this stuff that's pulling me so many different directions? My goodness. Okay. Okay, where am I? What am I doing? Uh, I needed... I need... What do I need? I need to find that natural gas thing. Uh, where was it? Oh my! Okay. 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 Calm down. Calm down, please. Thank you. Okay. I need to find that natural gas. Uh, where was that? Was that on the other side here? Apparently it was the boots that was causing a little bit of the issue there. Aha! I think it was here. This looks... Mildly familiar. Was it yeah, right there? Okay, so a lot of you are saying that I need to go down further. Uh, so I'm going to do just that. We're going to... Oh, God. I hear an Enderman. Uh, that's a bit of a problem. Let's dig down a little bit further and see what we can come up with. Actually, I'm wondering, should we maybe... Um, let's think about this. Should we maybe block ourselves in, right? Cut off the water from seeping down and into us and all that jazz. Okay, let's see. Does that fix us? Oh, God, it got really dark, though. 
And this is flammable. Oh, that might not be smart. Okay, let's take this again. Uh, let's go back into the water. Yeah, yeah, I wasn't thinking that through. Okay, get rid of you, you, and you. Okay, good. And let's just dig down a little bit more. At least we have the aqua affinity, right? Okay. Yeah, yeah, I hear you guys. Settle down. I'm just trying to look for natural gas. Back into abyssal. Really? Okay. There's a lot of abyssal down here. I'm not seeing the nausea issues yet. Uh, we still have loads and loads of mana, so that won't be an issue. Okay, how far down do I have to go with this thing? I'm not seeing nausea. Really? Really, sir? Okay. Still nothing. Still nothing. Okay, we're well, gonna keep going. We're going all the way down here, guys. Until we start to feel a little bit sick. I did leave the air pump upstairs, though. Uh, but we might need a new pick anyways. <laughs> um, yeah. If it's this low. I'm still not getting the nausea debuff. Um, so I'm a little confused there. I didn't expect it to be this low. Oh. Is this it? Or is this just a cave? Oh, no. There's a creeper. Okay, okay. Yeah, that's just a cave. That's pretty deep. I mean, I've dug pretty darn deep already. Um... I'm a little confused as to the issues at hand here. What was that? What did I get hit by? Did you guys see that? I got hit by something. I swear to God. Okay. Uh, anyways, uh, I guess let's keep going. I'm going to dig all the way down. If I find something, I'll be back with you guys. Alrighty, so that looks like bedrock to me. Uh, and I don't uh, feel any nauseous or anything like that um, the whole way down. So, not too sure. I might have to find a new natural gas reserve. I mean, maybe it's in this little section here, but uh, for some reason I'm not thinking so. So, a little bit of a annoyance, I guess you could say. Uh, but yeah, I kind of dug all the way down with little to no reward here. So, yeah. Anyways, um, I'm going to find another natural gas, I guess. Uh, bubbles out there. And we'll go from there. Yeah. That's a shame. Okay. Uh, back to finding some other natural gas bubbles. We still have lots of mana, so that doesn't seem to be an issue anytime soon here. So I'm just going to, you know, scope out the uh, ocean floor, see what I can see. Alrighty, so I think this is another one here. This stupid kelp keeps messing me up. So as far as I can tell, I need to dig down here. I got the air pump this time. So let's see uh, about this. So it's right here. Uh, down into the limestone, I guess. Uh, I'm probably gonna go beside it as well. Good. So it should be right down here somewhere. Okay. Okay. This is an opening. Okay. 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 Very big opening. A lot bigger than I thought it would be. Um, I'm poisoned. Okay, is this what does it? Weakness, mining fatigue, poison. Okay, I'm assuming that this is the required thing. Okay, okay. Don't die. 
No, I can't. It's not enough space. Okay. Okay. Um. Okay. Okay. Stop. Stop, please. Okay. Let's get up here. All right. So it was that other cave. Okay. Good. We'll just get up. I don't want to die. Uh, let me think about this. The pump needs a decent amount of space uh, to function. So if I go there, it's still red, hey? Is the water affecting it? The water could be affecting it. Okay, this could get very dark uh, for... You know what? Let's just push this out. Yeah, this might be a better idea. I don't seem to be taking any poison damage if I'm in the water. So that might be an, a good strategy um, for you guys. Oh, no. Okay. Okay. Ow. Ow. Stop it. Please. Stop. 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 Pushing me around, water. Okay. Okay. We're fine. We're fine. Oh, God. Okay. Give me this. Thank you. You go there. You break. Okay, do you have enough room now? No, still don't have enough room. Are you serious? Why not? Okay, let's dig out underneath it. Alright, alright. Okay, this is a little annoying. Not gonna lie. Okay, uh, you go down there. Stop it. Stop it. Okay. 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 That's enough of that. Okay, we're taking this off. Let's put back on the diving helmet. Okay, still not enough room. It's probably very dark for you guys. It's dark for me too, but I want to get this thing going. Still not enough room. What are you talking about, bro? Bro, if you... Do not have enough room. Oh god, that scared me. Okay. Still not enough room. Great. He's super picky. Okay. Um This kind of opens up into a cave. I don't know why I'm all of a sudden not getting poisoned. Uh that's very interesting to me. But I'm okay with it. Okay. Um I wonder. There we go. Okay, so it's kind of like right over here. Okay. Alright, let's get out of here. Let's go repair the pickaxe and try to get this situated. Oh my god, this is annoying. Alrighty, so the water was causing an issue, so I got that all situated. Let's get out of here. Holy cow. That was a pain in the butt to do. And you know, one of the things, like, I've never been a huge Mariculture fan, okay? Because I don't really like fishing, right? But that was rather annoying. Um, so I did, I was smart, and I brought an entire tank with me. So this tank, as you can see, it is full of natural gas. Now, I'm hoping there's an easier way to do that, because that was rather annoying. Simple as that. Uh, but anyways, so we got the natural gas. We should, should, keep being the keyword, let's get back up to our base. We should be good to go. I travel so much faster underwater. And you know what? Now that we have this ring, maybe we could look into doing some underwater builds. That could be pretty cool. It's kind of one of the things that I was hoping to get to do in this world a little bit. So we might look into that as well. Okay, so, let's see the quest book. We have the bottle of natural gas. Claim reward. Nice. Oh, those are all full of natural gas now. Okay, then. Alrighty. Beautiful. Okay. 
So that's done. And there's no other quest. Are you freaking kidding me? Uh, this one, what do we need? Avoid transport pipe. Okay. Avoid transport pipe. Is ink redstone? Redstone? I don't have any redstone. What kind of malarkey is this? Okay, well, I'm not doing that at the moment. Uh, okay, so not too, too bad. I think that we learned some things. I think we've expanded on a few things as well. Uh, we got a decent amount of limestone. We did get some materials, right? That we can utilize and look towards to do different things. Um, we did get our alchem alchemy, alchemy catalyst, which there's a ton of recipes for. Like rotten flesh to leather, for example. We got these white pearls, which look like they're kind of used for, like, neoprene and upgrades and stuff like that. So, that's kind of cool, I guess. I don't really know too, too much about them. Uh, but we're going to save them. Put them in our mariculture thing. Uh, the bottle of natural gas, again, is neoprene. Or to get some sort of plastic, apparently hard plastic and yeah so lots of cool cool things that we've come across already in the world as we're adapting and expanding um, we definitely need to get a few other things going though we should probably get that done getting a reward of nether brick not really necessary um, actually before we go I want to see do I have enough nether I might one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. Plus the two. I think that's the eight I need. Yeah, that's the eight I need. Okay. Let's get ourselves the... Uh, this guy. No, not that guy. This guy. The blaze stuff. The essence of blaze. So eight essence of nether. 32 nether brick. Nine regular essence. And 32 floral... Powder. Okay, nine. Good. And brown. Brown. 32 with the mortar and pestle. Get that going. And like that. Beautiful. Okay. Quest. Manually submit. Claim the reward. Very nice. Now we can make ourselves our blaze seed. Which requires, let's just take a look, uh, two Essence of Blaze. Really? I gotta do that again? Okay, Rune of Fire, Rune of Air. So, I need to do that one more time. So basically, I need more nether stuff. Well, anyways guys, that's gonna be it for this episode. It's already super duper late. And... Yeah, pretty much time for me to uh, to hit the hay. Daylight savings was today, so my entire schedule is just all out of whack. But what can you do? And uh, anyways, thanks for watching the video so, so much. I love all of you guys. Anybody who watches this video is truly loved. You guys help keep everything flowing and, you know, just just make me a general nice guy. So thanks again. And I look forward to seeing and talking to you guys with any ideas and stuff like that for the video. Thank you, thank you, and have yourselves a good one. Bye-bye for now.